Alright, let's do more of Elijah School's idea. I saw one minute of the 30 minute ranking B3 characters, and I haven't, they only uploaded B3 camp videos, so let's do this! Variety! Also, please go subscribe to Elijah School, she's uh, pretty sick. Alright, let's begin. The best. I'm gonna say one for the best and one for the worst, because, you know, there can only be one the best. Alright, Dora. Now, Dora, she is very underrated. She's the most helpful, she was the most helpful on Blair, you know, that team. I'm gonna put her on like. Eraser, pretty okay character. Um, not really much special to him. Uh, Pi, once again, uh, nothing much special to her. She's just, you know, there. Pillow is trash. Pillow sucks. She's not the worst, but she sucks. TV? I like TV, but not enough to put in like. TV's okay. For the character she is, she is okay. Oi, I don't know. Animatronics. Who knows anymore? What is life? David. Okay. Um, in Elijah Scores video, she said that David was funny. I don't think David's funny. I think David is slightly annoying because David has only said three words, make that two words and one sound in the entirety of David's existence. Actually make that three words one sound. He he said ah, oh, he said seriously, he said yeah, he said no. Kinda gets on my nerves. David's in dislike. Bobby! No no, Bobby's had some pretty good quotes throughout BFB. Like, um, life is meaningless, give me a banana. That is my uh Tinder that is my Tinder bio. I I like Bobby, he's pretty cool. Why? Now, the, the community on Y is pretty split. You have people like that lie guy who enjoy their character and want to see more of them, but then there's also 80% of the people who watch BFP which hate Y and that's why Lie got eliminated third. I'm putting Y in like. I'm on team that lie guy. Vly is a pretty interesting character, and I actually wanted to see more of her, but it's tough luck she got eliminated, so. Fanny, yeah, I don't like evil characters. Fanny is one of those, um, what's the word? What's the word when you're constantly negative, opposite of Optimus? Um, negacist. She she's a negacist, and I don't like that. I like other people to be optimist, so I can be the only negacist. Just like Snowball. I used to really to hate Snowball, but now Snowball's an alright character. Don't think much of them. Tennis ball. I really like tennis ball. Tennis ball is like my number three, but this there can only be one of the best. Only one. Only one. Tree, once again, average character. Nothing spectacular. Black hole. Mmm. Ooh, that's a tough one. I I'm I'm what should I do? Ooh, ooh, I'm gonna put him like Black Hole's pretty funny. And yeah, black hole's supportive as well. Book. Ooh, I'm gonna put Book in the okay. I don't like book at all for what he did to Taco. Pre split, pre split Taco was okay. Pre split Taco was pretty good. Don't at me about the after split. So I don't like that about book, but what balances it out is that book is a team leader and I like leadership. I like good team leaders. So that kind of balances it out to okay. Gaty, average, nothing. I don't see anything of it. Coiny, I'm gonna say for later. Remote, another basic ass character. Spongy, 
Yeah, Spongy's going in the dislike. Got a little bit. Okay. Pre-split? Near the end before the split? Got pretty obnoxious with the whole, Oh, you all forgot about me. I'm not that important to you guys. After split, I like that the attempted relationship with Taco was there. It wasn't executed well, especially considering Spongy got eliminated second after pre-split, making Spongy the first character in BFB to be eliminated twice. How spectacular. Naily, average. Alright, next. Saw. Cool. Tough one. I'm gonna go okay. Pretty good character. I would put them in like, but Saw, I would say Saw doesn't get enough screen time. Fry's dislike, just annoying. The voice alone sets me off. Leafy. Oh, Leafy could go in any of these right here. Leafy? I'm, uh, I'm focusing on one person right here on my opinion on Leafy. You know who you are. Leafy! That makeup scene with Fiery. I don't usually like sentimental stuff, but it's stuff like that. Oh my god, it breaks me. But, in the later episodes, BFE, 23 and 24, she's reverted to her, um, controlling self. Not controlling. Control freak. So, I'm gonna put Leafy in, okay. Uh, Yellow Face. Yellow Face is pretty funny. Not gonna lie. Ice Cube! I like Ice Cube! That was horrible. But I like Ice Cube. She's pretty funny. Marka, once again, okay, nothing special. Taco, kinda sucks. Mm. Mm, sh should I give it the benefit of the doubt? Ah! Uh, uh, no, she's staying there. Her after split? Okay, her pre split was basically only for her personality and er all of her character aspects was focused on the book and taco rivalry. After Split, she became a mom. Then her only relations were with Blocky. So it was like, Blocky! Yada yada, stuff like that. <laughs> it's kind of annoying. Flower. Ooh, another tough one. I'm gonna put her in okay. I would have put her in like, but. Oh, she's gone pretty average, right? Lose her easy dislike. Oh my god. The last few episodes Lose was in, he became such a narcissist. Pen. Ooh, Penny Boy. Penny Boy with the cap. With the cap and stuff. Like. Pretty solid character. For that group of Blocky, Eraser, Pen, and Snowball, Pen is definitely the best out of all of them. Pen has a great personality, but is not the best. I'll show you who the best is later. It might be cool. Brassy. Pretty average. Got nothing to him. All you can do is say, I'm Bradley. Just about it. Almost in dislike because of the foul thing where he gave away the coordinates of that emerald once, but pff, we don't talk about it here. Alright, Thunder, let's see. Um... Mm, okay. I don't really find uh, Lightning that amusing. But, whatever. Pencil, dislike, and while we're at it, matching dislike. They're pretty bad characters. Match, bossy, pencil, bossy. Pencil's a tiny bit better than match because match is that classic, oh let's go to the mall, we're gonna get so much makeup, we're gonna get, oh we're gonna get such healthy vegan shakes. Pencil's like, like an ant step above that but still pretty garbage. Oh. Eh, screw it. You go here. Alright, Eggie. Dislike. Pretty bad. 
I don't even know, I don't even have to say why. All right, nickel. Like a larger score. I don't know how to say that. If I'm saying it wrong, just tell me. Like a larger score said in her video, nickel in I I has a much better uh, personality there. Yes. Nickel in BFB is very bland. Not bad, but also not good. Teardrop. I like silent characters. I really like silent characters. They add a whole lot more like depth to the show. I and I'm really mad about how silent characters get treated, especially in Total Drama Revenge of the Island B. Should, my man should not have gotten eliminated that oh Ugh. Pin? Pin, oh we're gonna leave these two for later. Bracelet. Oh, oh, I could trigger some people right now. Oh, I could trigger some people. Okay. Bracelet is okay. At first, I thought Bracelet was obnoxious. Obnoxious. Then I kind of felt bad for them knowing that they've been in. They've been eliminated for the longest time. Ever. And, you know, after coming around, Bracelet is a pretty good character. A little obsessive, a little bit Yandare with Ice Cube, but pretty good character. Golfball, that's a definite like. That's a team lead, leader if I've ever seen one. Wow. Let's just put it out there. Rocky, cute. That's what I need to say. Bubble. Ooh, my opinion of Bubble has just gone downhill lately. Bubble is an okay. She used to be a good character, I mean, that's why she got third in BFDI, but after the whole match uh, thing, she's really just lost character development. Clock, easy, dis- oh, that's real far. <laughs> Clock, easy, dislike, really, just whatever character. Robert Flower, interesting, interesting character. I like that there's variants on all of these different characters, like, um, there's David and Dora, uh, Flower and Robot Flower, there's Fiery and Fiery Jr. I think that's pretty fun. Uh, Belle. Oh god. It's the voice that sets me off. I really don't like the voice. Alright, Ruby is gonna be another one I save for later. Needle. I like Needle. She is a good team player. And yeah, iconic cake. Okay, not much character over there except for loser save us. Something like that. Birth bag. The mom of Team Ice Cube. Some people hate her. Some people love her. I'm putting her in okay because yeah, she's just tough, but be it, but pre be it, be split. Uh, oh no. Oh, we're getting to some controversial ones. I'm saving Woody as well. Le I'm keeping these four for later. Fiery, yeah, just like, his, his character is bland. Yeah, that's all I've got to say. Stapy! Just like as well. I thought, like, most of the characters in here, bland, but... Well, most of the characters in here, bland. But after cheating... Yeah, that put it down to just like April, annoying, really just shouldn't have done what he did. Bottle, pretty funny at times. And Bubble's dead. I can't do a little voice. Robotty. Well, it's obvious. Well, Robotty's gonna go. The best. No. Robotty isn't okay because, you know, what else can you get out of two the hunks of metal stuck together? Cardi. I like Cardi. He's pretty fun. He's pretty fun. I like Cloudy. He makes the funny sound. Uh, Blocky. <clears throat> like. We've gotten a lot better post split. I, I will say his relationship with Woody, I love because now he's been become more accepting of Woody. And uh, I don't know, it's pretty good. Oh, yeah, basketball's in his life. It's it's fun. 
I like how he became a bully. He, he um, became from a bully to a friend of Woody. And now Woody is his successor. It's so funny. Anyway, gelatin, I'm gonna trigger so many people if I don't put them in at least like. Mmm, God. Oh, this is actually tough. Oh, oh. I'm putting gelatin in, okay. That's gonna trigger some people, but this is my opinion. You have your own, you can suck your own toes if you want to. Gelatin has slowly had um, a character de development. He was funny post uh, pre split. He was a good comedic relief. I mean, how could you forget the classic? Don't you mean the tinkle of contagion? And yes, I am six years old. Something like that. Uh, but yeah, after post split, he was still that comedic relief, but Blocky already kind of filled that spot. So, Gelatin just got slightly more irrelevant every other episode. And in the most recent episode, I feel like he's just not the same as he used to be. Foldy! Okay, nothing to it. Uh, Donut! I like Donut again, another good team leader, and you know how I feel about team leaders. Donut does his job very well. Lollipop! I'm gonna put Lollipop in like. I. I don't like how bossy Lollipop can be, but. Her being bossy is kind of what makes her being good. Like, her sarcasm is a good comic relief. That's so jolly. It's a good uh, uh, comic relief. Not like, oh, hey, look, I'm doing a funny thing. Haha, <laughs> I'm gelatin. It, it's like, it casually slips in there and it's done so well. Um, let's see, Puffball. Ooh, I'm gonna have to put Puffball in the district here ever since BFDIA5E. She's just gotten obsessive over winning. Literally sabotaging her, her own team just to get a prize. Cheating, helping uh, Stacey cheat. And, um, just being kind of rude in general. Yeah. Paluni. Paluni is a big fat like, and no, that's not out of um, sympathy for what happens in BFP 17 or 18 and 18. Balloon is pretty funny. Not like comic relief style, but you know, he's there. He's pretty good, and I like that. Now, the um, final judgment before um, I decide who's the best and who's the worst. I've already decided who the worst is, and it's Fiery Jr. He's a little brat, and I hate him. Enough said. And I also think, actually not enough said, because I also think it's pretty funny how he got um, exactly 10,000 votes. That's just um, the 16 cherries on top of the cake, or however they say it. Alright, now it's these four. These four I've been saving because they're special to me. These are my top four. A little controversial a bit here, but these three I, I bet most people can agree with. Now, Coiny? Wow, he's gone much better since BFDI from Coiny Slapper to literal emotional support. For Pin. How, like, come on! That's character development if I've ever seen it. These two are inseparable, and oh my god, Queen does such a good job of helping his um, team. Pin, like I've said, team leaders are great, Pin is great, and overall the entire community agrees that Pin is a great character. It's like vast majority. I've seen ranking videos and I've seen pin up there. Ruby is funny. Ruby is funny. 
There are so many clips of her being funny, but not just that, helpful and important. It's great. Now, Woody is my most controversial one. Most of you will put Chuck him right over here. Most will put him here. Some will put him here. Very few will put him here. But am I going to put him here? Mm -hmm. Now, I like how Woody has developed since BFDR. He used to be a scaredy cat, just afraid of everything. Back then, when I watched BFDI for the first time, I didn't think much of Woody. I really didn't. But something inside me, I always have to root for the underdogs. And Woody was such an underdog before he blew up. He got he placed dead last in BFDI after all the rejoins. He was barely noticed throughout I, uh, BFDIA and IDFB. He wasn't even in BFDIA and screamed in IDFB after being burnt alive. But BFB was his come around. Woody, for some reason, just gained. Uh, he gained so much bravery. I could list episodes and most of you would disagree because Woody's overrated and stuff. Oh, well, I don't think he's overrated. I think he's perfectly rated. He's he's even underrated from all the overrated comments putting him down. Woody is awesome. Now I don't need to shop, but of course I respect your opinions and whatever. But the best the best BFB character in my opinion. Not Pin. Pin is great, but man, these three characters beat them out. It is not Woody, because people will go too insane and yell at me, and I would receive the most disliked YouTube video on YouTube. Oh, in my personal opinion, Corny is the best. Corny is so good. I love Corny. Corny is amazing. And oh my god. I don't know. He's just perfect. He, he's great. He really is. As a team. As emotional support. As the team leader. As a person in general. His relation. He, even his relationship with Fiery has gotten better. Like, when they see each other, they don't instinctively want to slap them a million times. He's just gone so much better. That's all I have to say. Well, there's my plagiarized video, and I hope you guys enjoyed that, because, oh my, why do I keep copying things? I'm literally the most unoriginal person on planet Earth. Go subscribe to, to, go subscribe to the Legend Score, and I'll see you guys probably in another BFB camp video, because, once again, I'm unoriginal. Bye!